Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to another reading. We'll start off with the ruling planets, elements, and zodiac signs for extra confirmation as we open the spread. But don't worry, those don't have to resonate. If the storyline does, great. Now, the ruling planets, Mercury, which came up twice, Venus, the Sun, and Saturn came up once. The elements, earth, came up twice, fire came up twice, and air once. And for the zodiac signs, Leo came up twice, Virgo, Gemini, and Taurus came up once. Let's get started with your reading. Hello, Prince Charming. Hello, King of Pentacles. How are you? We're starting off looking at a very optimistic energy coming your way. What I love about this energy is that it's so eager, you know? It's like, I'm here. I know what this is because I was ready for it, okay? And this person comes in with many blessings and rewards, not only because of their energy, but because of the good choice that you will make or have already made, all right? we have the 10 of coins. Usually when we make the right choice in love, the right person for us, that comes with financial blessings. That's the biggest well done you can get from the universe, okay? This connection is going to draw a lot of eyes. So there may be a lot of people who will be watching this connection or who may be watching this connection and seeing how it grows, like truly nervous about the progress of this connection because this person's energy just hits different, okay? And then we have the lovers, which I love, making the right choices in love, okay? The lovers can also represent a confirmation in love or a choice in love, and this person's definitely going to choose you. It's undeniable. I always say look for the keywords. What is this person talking about? Is it resonating with where you are currently in your life, where you're headed? What's going on when you meet? Can you relate to them? You know, those are some of the signals from the universe where you can realize, okay, this is the type of person I've been manifesting. This is the right one. This is the type of person I want to give my energy to, okay? Because it has to be a responsible and conscious decision. At some point, we have to exercise the healing and learning that we have within our journey, okay? Damn. I think it's more of there's this chaotic energy that's been summoned from the past. It's like past love. I feel like they're going to be, once you are settled in this connection and people get to know more about it, I feel the audacity from the past, angel number 227 on the timer for you. I definitely feel the audacity from the past. Do not be tempted to go back to what the universe saved you from. Because at first, yeah, it's understanding. And then the next, the universe is like, oh, you need a slap across your face. Okay. <laughs> if somebody Fs you over, they're going to F you over again you know, behavior is a pattern. It's not an accident or a coincidence. All right. There's a lot of little flies flying here, fruit flies. I don't even know how they got in here, but usually that says some nosy, nosy ass people around protect this connection. I feel like it's okay for people to know that it's your person, but people shouldn't know your business, okay? And I'm setting the intention for both of you to not discuss each other with people who wouldn't have your best interests at heart. Angel number triple three on the timer and ascended master number to confirm that. Then we have strength. This person has the endurance, okay? They will endure whatever needs to be endured to be your number one. I, this person has no competition. You can't compete with the person like this. You'll be setting yourself up to fail because this is not a quitter. This is not, oh, it's a bad day, let's quit. No, no, no. It's not, oh, it's a bad day, let's throw everything away that we've been putting so much work into. No, 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 no. <laughs> This is a, oh, you 
think you can have my spot. You think. But truth will show, no baby, you can't, okay? I'm going to get the love oracles out early. So what can you expect from this connection as it's unfold? And let's clarify with that energy, okay? This is a complex love, but I think the love itself is not complex. The journey to the love has been complex. But as this love comes in, you'll be able to realize, ah, okay, this is what I was preparing for. This is why I can enter it in such a calm, peaceful energy because I know what I'm ready for. I know what I can do. I know what I can't do. And I've surrendered to that, you know, I've given the control to the divine. To clarify, the king of pentacles we have very soon. Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. Mm, Spirit saying it's okay to look back. It's okay to look back sometimes, but don't allow looking back to hinder your future, to hinder you from making the right choice. Because all of your lessons were supposed to teach you how to make decisions, go through the motions in a mental state that is grounded and balanced. You know, you have people who've worked so hard for other people not to even make them react, right? So it's the same challenge. It's the same test. It's the same training. Do not be resentful about their training. Do not be bitter about the training because you want it better for yourself. You know your value. You know what you deserve, right? So the training will complete at some point and you have to now put into practice everything that you've learned up until this point, okay? And don't be faced by anything that has happened up until this point. Give yourself a clean slate as you walk into this connection because this is what you were meant to do. You know what I mean? This is what you were meant to be in. So don't bring any baggage into it. The Ten of Coins is clarified by playfulness. To recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit to shine. What a beautiful confirmation. I feel like... If you give this connection a good go, give it a really good investment, you're going to have perfect work-life balance. <laughs> you know what I mean? So you'll have a partner that you can actually rely on, you know? Because at some point, it's like, yeah, the BS, it was entertaining for a little while. But, you know, people want stability. People want homes. People want someone they can rely on. Someone when they look over their shoulder, they're like, okay, they have my back. Okay. They have my back. I know that person has my back through thick and thin, you know, through hell and high waters. You know what I'm saying? And I just feel like this connection is going to be so blessed. It's going to be blessed in so many beautiful ways. And it's going to bring so much abundance. It's giving power couple vibes. You know, someone you can just do your thing with, you know. They do their thing, you do your thing, you do your thing together. You feel me? Yes. The lovers, we have free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. Both of you are letting go of a lot of things that don't serve you going through a cleansing okay but I just feel like no need to worry everything is secure here okay you won't need to question you won't need to be hyper vigilant <laughs> you won't need to you know have lots of anxiety question yourself you know, always wondering like, does this person prioritize me? No, 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 honey. It'll be automatic. It'll be on default. And you'll be like, ah, <laughs> we just look at that. Now my manifestation, look at me living it. The five of wands is clarified by a retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. Ah, oh, I love this. I love the combination of these two cards. It's just like when you two are together, we'll be together, spend time together. It will just be a, such a beautiful, beautiful time, a beautiful space. The world will disappear, you know. I think this is creating your own worlds. Yes, people want them. Yes, people want you, but you want each other, okay? You'll have the best fit of all, so don't worry about what's outside of your connection, trust how your person is showing up, you know? 
the strength co- oh and they're saying oh damn hold on <laughs> too many hits at one time yeah okay we forgot that one if we remember it we'll come back to it the strength card oh yeah so they were saying that this person will allow you to know them on a level that no one has ever known them before you feel me yeah most most definitely true love to clarify the strength card this is the romance of a lifetime angel number 944 i love that cue the epic pop disney song <laughs> yes i love this this is gorgeous guys honestly no complaints here no pushing forward i mean no weird stagnant energy no having to persevere rather than push it forward you know what i mean it's such clean and simple as it should be should make sense from a to z okay now what do the twin flames want you to know about this connection moving forward we're going to use the twin flame deck okay what would the twin flames like for you to know they're saying this person's gonna curb their passion or their appetite yay yay <laughs> to get to know you on a deeper level but this person's incredibly passionate about you they want to jump your bones okay so don't worry this person when they come in if they're not coming yet or if they're here they're going to give you a great balance of that passion of that ambition <laughs> you know what i'm saying <laughs> yes because especially for the feminines what turns us on is security and stability and protection that's what turns us on yes angel number triple one five <laughs> yeah that would turn the hell on out of me <laughs> okay so what would the trip flames like for you to know <laughs> angel number 1133 <laughs> you know don't talk about a mortgage talk about buying it all right baby yeah <laughs> now that shit gonna tell me on. <laughs> Angel number 114 and the timer for you. Confirmation from the Twin Flames with the Ace of Cups. A new day. It's a new love. It's a new love. Leave that dust in the past. Okay, stop it. Let that ish go. Okay, the sooner you let it go. <laughs> and you better do it quick. Fix yourself up and go. get back out there. Go on a date or something. Angel number 211, especially if you put your best foot forward, especially if you know, like, I was good to that person. I really did my thing. Angel number one, triple two, take that goodness and take it to somebody else's door if the person doesn't appreciate it and do it quick. Okay. Give yourself two weeks maximum. <laughs> I said two weeks is more than enough. Over two weeks, you've overdone it. You're stuck in those trenches. Okay. You're knocking on the door of depression at that point, babes. You know, designate a time to honor your emotions and then let it go, okay? And let it go. The Three of Pentacles, the Four of Swords, the Hermit Energy, and the Eight of Pentacles. Pace yourself. Pace yourself. You don't have to rush this. It's already yours. Both of you have been working so diligently to get to this point, and it's not been pretty. It's not been a pretty journey. Okay, let's get some more Oracle clarifiers, the Ace of Cups. I'm really trying to squeeze this reading out, but it's very, very clear. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Lord Shiva Transcendence, rise up, honor your inner force. Steps are being given, dance with the universe. Now, Shiva ain't nothing to play with, okay? Angel number 113, Shiva ain't nothing to play with. Angel number 339, this connection so divinely protected and i think just what this person's bringing into your life is the love and support and help you've needed and it's not just extending to them it's extending to other people you know they're bringing a force with them you know and your arsenal combined with their arsenal is just going to shoot you both straight to the stars okay 
Mother Mary, love and peace. Let go of the need to be right. Choose peace. Mother healing is possible at this time. The Three of Pentacles, clarifying the Three of Pentacles. Yeah. Hmm. Very interesting here. The thing with this relationship, you know I'm a very connection type of person to say the word, right? But now we're going to use the R word relationship, not R-rated. Stop it. <laughs> The thing about this relationship, it's going to offer you a different perspective in regards how you should love and take care of yourself. It's going to offer you the space to take care of yourself. Angel number 114, angel number 447. Because there have been a lot of divine beings who've been pushing forward by themselves, you know, very hard for a very long time, trying their best to connect, but not getting the connection they desire, right? This is the one. In okay, case so it's... it's Remember, it's going to make complete sense. It's not going to confuse you. You're not going to be up the wall. You're not going to be crashing out. You're not going to be doing all those things. It's just going to make perfect sense, okay? All right. Age number five to two. Sorry, I'm a little itchy, child. I think it's the hormones. I don't know if it's the bugs or the hormones. It's one of them either, but the message going to get out. <laughs> My bestie, Mary Magdalene. <laughs> the Four of Swords, clarified by Mary Magdalene, teaches, teacher awakens. You have something important to share. Follow the inner call. Don't let anything stop you. Remember the whole story of Jesus and Mary Magdalene. It's like so many people were so ready to misjudge her, but he was willing to be considerate. You feel me? You feel me? Because he's his, she is his twin flame in this deck. And I'm just going to double check that because, honey, <laughs> even though I'm autistic, I know things. So I just got to double check if I said the right thing. But I just feel like the compassion, the way the message is coming through is the compassion this person's going to show you and the way this person's going to see you is unlike any other. You know, sometimes you'd be like, I don't know if you get it. And then you realize, wow, you are paying attention. <laughs> you are really paying attention. And this is part of what makes this person undeniable. Mm hmm. Oh, the hermit and one of my favorite twin flames in this deck Krishna and Radha. I love the message to each other in this deck. Krishna says, Devotion. Trust your spiritual guidance. Your commitment has been recognized. You are loved unconditionally. And when Krishna arrives, what arrives? Your counterpart. You know, the one you've been calling in. And they're saying, which is Radha's message. What was she saying? She was saying, focus on yourself and your talents. I need to find that card. So y'all gonna have to wait because I really love her message in here. Okay. So you're just gonna be patient with me because I'm definitely not editing this out either. Radha, where are you? There she is. So Radha's journey begins. She says, rediscover lost part of yourself, experience relationship, harmony, and healing. And then Krishna, her counterpart here, says, Trust your spiritual guidance. Your commitment has been recognized. You are loved unconditionally. Bam. This person's such a dark horse, intellectually, spiritually, emotionally. I think there's just going to be a beautiful present to open up, you know? And this is a love you can grow in. So just keep taking the right steps and trust. That's all you have to do. And follow the synchronicities. Because what is supposed to be simple and makes sense. The Eight of Pentacles is clarified by Green Tara. Supreme protection. You are protected. Cords are being cut. Move beyond limitation and trust. The future is freaking bright, baby. The future is freaking bright. The future is not only bright, but it's also protected. Okay. And I feel like you inspire this person to diligently go towards their goals. When they've seen... What effort you've put into your life, especially spiritually, it inspires them. And that's what your person's supposed to do. You know, be inspired, work together. They inspire you, you inspire them. Life makes sense, you move together. That's it, angel number 191. And everything you've been th through in love up until this point, it was to confirm that 
sh- shit is supposed to be simple like you know it's not supposed to be that hard you find someone who finds sense in the same things you value and that's it okay let's get some ancestor cards and then we'll close out your reading because this one was nice and simple i love this one straight to the point i squeezed out all the juice i could <laughs> okay lord take charge with authority if there's a situation that's taking your power back and blocking you from being open to this you need to call your power back to you you need to wake up you need to wake up okay you need to get out your head and you know how you get out your head you force your daily routine you get up and get it done by the end of the day you'll be back in your zone angel number 959 it's it's all mental it's all mental push through that energy people think this is supposed to be hard hell no it's not okay it's hell angel number 211 when have you noticed they say heaven on earth so that it's something in the prayer heaven on earth yeah because does this look like heaven to you <laughs> heart guardian love and let yourself be loved and that's all you gotta do just love it's just like this love's just supposed to feel like a luxurious bath you know midweek for no reason remember this is the ancestor card druid hold the space Hold the space means you know what it's like for someone to show up and for someone to not, okay? You're, this is not the type of person not to show up and you don't be the type of person that doesn't show up. Don't sabotage, basically. You feel me? Angel number 211. Deal with what you got to deal with. If you want a partner for life, you want to be married, do what you have to do. Learn how to be that person. Listen to people who are married who are happily married because they're putting in the effort into their marriage to be happy, okay? Listen to people who are going to teach you to be the type of wife and the type of husband you need to be to have a successful marriage. It's more than just about love. You know, it's about capability, responsibilities, adaptability, you know, and as well, collaboration. Mm -hmm. angel number 211 and angel number 141 to end your reading until the next time